What's up, everybody? What's going on? I hope all of y'all are doing undeniably fan freaking tastic out there. I know why I am, because today, it looks like I'm going to be going on an adventure to Myrtle Beach. And, folks, I have not been to Myrtle Beach since 2013. But, I need to give a special shout out to my new friend, Donnie. Donnie, he's been helping me out with, like, a lot of stuff over the past month. And he just, like, invited me, like, right out of the blue. So, I don't know what to expect today, but I guess I'm just ready to go to Myrtle Beach now. So, yeah, without any further ado, without any further delay, let's go ahead and uh, see what footage I got, okay? Oh yeah, before we get there though, I think I might want to change shirts, but, you know what, travel montage! Folks, it's been nine years, but I have finally returned. Your boy, Self Standard, has returned to Myrtle Beach. And notice the shirt I'm wearing. Yeah, the John Cena shirt. I had to wear this shirt specifically today because the last time I was here, 2013, it was WrestleMania 29. It was the day of WrestleMania 29. And... I wore this shirt that same day. So I don't know what this video is going to entail, but stay tuned for whatever. Folks, it feels super, super good to be back here in my own beach. Like, look, you got Barney with the yellow belly right there. Ripley's owns this neighborhood. I used to be very scared of this place. I was very scared of this place indeed. And it's good to see the dolphin is still gay after all these years. This is spectacular. I get to whack a stooge here. Yeah, but no shump. That's disappointing. No shump. I wanted to hit shump. Alright. I'm right handed, so I have to do it like this. Let's see if I can do Plinko here. Good luck! Ready? Three, two, 
I can't remember the last time I did a claw machine, but folks, I actually won this in the claw machine. I should have documented that. Hey folks, so what my tickets that I earned, this is what I got. Got a Laffy Taffy, got a cowtail, got a plane, and I got a flute. So, yep, those are my winnings. Hello, Ocean. Say something. All you want to do is just sit there and wait. They're trying to fly away, but they can't. The wind is too strong for them. Come on. Come on, Steven, you got this. Steven Siegel. Yesterday was incredible, like I'm filming this outro the day after our trip. Like we, we got back about 1.30 this morning. Yeah, and um like what I couldn't record or what I didn't record or what I didn't talk about while I was at the beach was that we also actually went into the uh zombie war zone area and yo know, folks quick review that place is insane like looking at it from the outside it looks a lot smaller than it really is so we was actually walking through the entire top floor of that entire section of the uh, strip of I think that's what it's called but yeah so we was walking on the top floor of some of the actual other stores too so that was very interesting but like a lot of it was just like pitch black walking from one room to the next in the hallways like if I was to just hold my hand up right in front of my face I couldn't see it that's how pitch black it was so yeah but like after that we also um went into the uh 4D moving theater 5D moving theater there's 5Ds and that was actually pretty cool too it makes me it, it makes me miss the uh Spongebob moving theater that used to be at Carowinds but, yeah, other than that, I really had a blast. Donnie, once again, thank you for the spontaneous adventure. And, it, again, just thinking back to last night, it was speechless. Th thank you very much. I hope you viewers out there enjoyed the video. If you did, give this video a big old thumbs up. And, uh, yeah, also, if you haven't already, I would greatly appreciate it if you subscribe too. So yeah, go hit that subscribe button down below, and yeah, until next time, make sure all of you remember to be outrageously optimistic year-round. Booyah, I'm out.